So, boom, hey, g -body, I'm telling you, don't do that, folks. Before I start this story, I need y'all to go over to the new page. Okay, so boom, one. I'm going to put the full story over. But look, check this out. For the members, though, I'm going to drop three on you today. I'm going to drop this one, and then I'm going to give you two more. And that's that's on your guy. But look, check this out. So I need a spicy summer size. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting ready to take care of my business. I don't really eat them regulars. Every now and then, I might put them in the tuna meal or something. But when I'm eating that chili or that chicken or the, or the beef stew, you know what I'm saying? I like that spicy summer size just cut up in mine. So I'm going through the bag, right? My celly, dang, hey, what's wrong? I dump everything out. I'm thinking my celly been stealing. And the only reason I'm thinking that because he see me going through my bag looking for something. And then when I dumped everything out on the floor, he was like, hey, we were like, what's up, celly? He was like, everything good? So I turn around, I look at him, he look at me, we look at each other. You know what I'm saying? Penitentiary rules in effect, my antennas go up. So I ain't worried about me going through my bag the way I'm going through the bag. Because evidently the way I'm looking through the bag is making him feel like I'm looking for something specific that he don't probably win in here and get. And he playing on replacing when it's thrown out. I said, what you got? I said, what's up, Sal? I said, you done took something out of my bag? He was like, no, no, no. I'm just wondering. He was like, man, you going through the bag like you lost something. I said, I did. I said, I ain't got no spicy summer sauces in He was like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So I was like. I'm going to come back around to that. I'm going to come back and look at my bag. You know what I'm saying? See what's going on. Because I know he liked them blueberry pop tart. Let me go. I'm going to come back. I'm going to see what's going on. See if something missed. So I'm going to go down and holler at one of the guys, right? And see if he got a spice or something. I know he, he deal with them regular. I'm going to go down here and swap him out. So I come out on the rock, right? <laughs> Run down here. I'm telling you, listen. I ain't out of the cell. Seven and a half seconds. Hey, Joe T. Joe T. Man, bro, I need to holler at you real quick. I'm on something right now, my guy. Man, for real, bro, I need to get at you. I know what you need to do. You want to use the phone. I ain't going to let you use the phone. I, it's one of them days. You know what I'm saying? I go down there, pop, pop, pop. When I tap on the door, I hear, man, I'm telling you, he said, man, come on. So I want to ask man, hey, hey, bro. He said, oh, what's up, what's up? So I mean, I, I need to holler at you real quick. It's man, come on, come on in, bro. Man, bless his ass. I mean, what's up? He said, man, what's up, Joe T? What you got going on? So I ain't doing out here, bro. Whatever, bro. He said, man, what's going on? He said, man, I need to holler at you. Like, man, for real, said, man, I need to, man, for real. What do you mean? He said, they got going on. You know what I'm saying? And one thing for sure, two things for certain about this brother, everybody know he get high. You know what I'm saying? They know his cell get high. That's the only reason why they in the cell again. I don't know if they in here, you know what I'm saying, discussing so maybe one got high without the other. I don't know. Or vice versa. Who, who knows what's going on with these two? <laughs> I don't know. So he fade out of the city. Like, man, what's up? She, I'm like, man, I'll come down and see if you a swap me. You know what I'm saying? Two uh, regular something, two spicy something for two regular. He like, man, bro, you just be taking out. I said, man, come on, bro, man. Man, that was up, bro. I got you. So he go under the bed, pull his commissary out. Go ahead and pull the commissary out. You know what I'm saying? I want to be a little known. Like, man, what's up with you selling, man? You good? Man, Joe T. Man, I done told him, bro. He either finna help me bust his move. He finna roll. I said, move? Yeah, you know I want to hear about that. I said, what you, what you talking about? He was like, man, so, you know, before I got fired down there in the kitchen, right, G? Little girl down there, you know what I'm saying? I had been trying to come up with, you know what I'm saying? But what she worked at in the kitchen, you know what I'm saying? I really don't want to see them. Every now and then, so I ain't really just get to shoot at her, right? You know what I'm saying? So I end up getting her name. So I end up looking up on Facebook, you know what I'm saying? Messaged her a little bit. She hit me back. You know what I'm saying? Finally, you know what I'm saying? I fade down there. You know what I'm saying? I'm down there and I had a chance to holler at her. You know what I'm saying? And the Facebook page is fake, right? So I fade her, you know what I'm saying? And as we talking, I mentioned some of the stuff we done talked about in the messenger uh, box. She was like, she kind of jumped out like, nah, 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 it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. And she was like, how you? And I was like, man, you know, this is the penitentiary, this, isn't that. And she, she wasn't even tripping on the phone or nothing like that. She, she wasn't even tripping on nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Then I ended up getting fired. One of the little dudes down there, you got me fired. Talking about I was down there stealing the sugar, right? So they caught me with the little blue packs or whatever. I'm coming out of the kitchen. Now, I don't never get searched, OT. I'm talking about even when I get, even when I have just got the pat down where they patting it. The, you know what I'm saying? They feel that on me. They still go ahead, go ahead. So this day, I don't know who he hollered at. You know what I'm saying? They pat me down. And you know what I'm saying? I, I'm talking about Joe. I'm talking about I got two boxes. Of, I got two boxes of the blue pack on me. I feel go up here and sell them to Billy. You know what I'm saying? Billy be making a white light. And I'm talking about Billy done already took care of me and everything, Joe T. But he already know penitentiary rules and fix some something, something go wrong. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna get him right or whatever. I just give it back to him. Whatever we go. However it go. So I'm, I'm talking about Joe. I'm talking about big. I'm talking about I got the whole box on me, Joe T. So also, he pat me down, right? And when he pat me down, he tell me stand out to the side. 
They ain't never did me like that, Joe T. I was sitting there like, man, what's going on? I'm standing right here. He pat everybody else down, tell them, go on. Go on. Go on. Then one of the dudes, you know what I'm saying? I, who I'm they pat him down. He tell him to go on. He just give me a little look. And I'm thinking, man, what was that about? So after everybody leaves, Joe T, the, 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 the main person come out. And they was like, oh, you got something you want to uh, tell me? I'm like, no. Nah. You got anything on you that belong to the kitchen? I'm like, oh, shoot, nothing on our way. You know what I'm saying? Because they already know I be bust move or whatever, right? So they were like, take the, take the coat off. So I take the coat off, hand it to the officer. I also pulled out the blue page right and was like, you do, you do know this finna come out of your state pay, right? I'm like, what? They're like, oh, yeah. This, this coming out of your state pay. We're going to put this back in there. I'm like, how it's going to come out of my state pay and y'all finna take it back and put it back in there? They're like, oh, it's coming out of the state pay. And uh, you, you, ain't even, you, don't, you don't got to come to work no more. You ain't got to come no more. I'm like, what? That's an automatic write-up. You know what I'm saying? They, they, finna, they finna hit me up for stealing. And then I, then I lost my job. Like, I'm like, Oh, yeah, yeah, I do. I do remember that, G. So, check this out. So, for the last two weeks or so, I had noticed, you know what I'm saying, my son come on to my, he got smoke in there. I'm talking about, he, he consistently blowing. He, he consistently blowing with me, Joe. I'm talking about, he coming in with that, I'm talking about loud pack. He coming in, you know what I'm saying, just enough for both of us to smoke. And then, I noticed that now and then, you know what I'm saying, he got a couple of apes on him. You know what I'm saying? He come in with a little sabbat. He got a little hustle going in there. Like, you know what I'm saying? Usually, I'm always feeding my son. He brings stuff in the kitchen. You know what I'm saying? He be hustling or whatever. But he had consistently been coming in with smoking. Then he gonna tell me. I'm gonna ask him, man, where you getting that from? Said he gonna tell me that uh he been swinging sandwiches. Joe T. He ain't never. He ain't never been swinging sandwiches. He might get out the kitchen with four five sandwiches. He come up here, get him a couple of summer sauces, some some pouches or something. Ain't no. Who, who been getting you smoke every day? You ain't bringing no exclusive. You ain't brought me no sound. So I'm saying, I'm thinking, no, t no homo. No homo, well, I'm you, no homo. So he had been coming in early, right? I know it's time my son to get off. You know what I'm saying? So I'm, I'm sitting here hitting one day, Joe T. I said, bro, that's, that's, that's TMI right there. He said, what, what's TMI, Joe T? I said, I don't know. My, me and my daughter were taking up day. You know, I was telling her something. She, you know what I'm saying? She was hitting me back. You know what I'm saying? And then I hit her and said, she was like, TMI. I was like, what that mean? And she take back talking about too much information. I said, you fuck I said, oh, I said well, excuse me. Too too much information. I said, what's up? The only thing I was telling you, they finna lock down. They finna do their count when they get through doing their count. I gotta put my phone up. She talking about some TMI. I said, that was something she don't worry about. So look, take this out. So I was like, oh, he was like, oh, that was He said, but anyway, so I'm in here eating. Then all of a sudden, I'm like, pop, pop, pop. And they knock on the door. You know what I'm saying? They pulled it though at the same time. So, see, man, I got up, you know what I'm saying? I'm putting the heat up or whatever. I thought, I, I, what was it? He was like, hey, Sally, Sally. He was like, yo, my Sally. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm, I'm thinking, I'm like, how long he keep getting out? Why he keep, how he keep getting out early? So, I popped the door, right? Pop. My Sally bust in real He was like, man, I got He was like, man, you holding, holding his butt like this right here. Man, he was like, man, I got his bathroom. I got his bathroom. So, he was like, man, let me, let me get the sale real quick, Sally. So I step out of the cell, you know what I'm saying? I let him take care of business or whatever. He come out of the cell. I'm standing in the park when he come out. So when he come out of the cell, right, he fade across the hall. When he fade across the hallway, you know what I'm saying? I ain't think nothing of it at first, you know what I'm saying? But then I know that this is his move every time he come in early. So one day I, I step in the cell, you know what I'm saying? Like the second or third time he did it, when he walked out, you know what I'm saying? I step in the cell. And I was just looking around, I noticed it's a lot of water, you know what I'm saying, it's dripping on the floor and stuff, right? And I'm like, oh, my cellar being a little sloppy, like he used bad water, oh, oh, wash his hand. And my cellar, I was like, when I was looking at how the water was splashed around, I was like, what my cellar playing in the same hand? Right? So Joe T, he did it another time, right? He come in now, before that, he said, man, he come in one day, he do it, boom. He come back over he had like he had some scratches on it. He had some scratches on his neck, right? So I'm like, dang, I'm like, what's up, Sally, man? What you got going on here? He's like, man, bro, it ain't nothing. He was like, man, I was down there at the kitchen today 
one of the dudes, man, the officer let me get the last couple of bird patties, man. He gonna pull me to the side and come out. Then my bird pat. Man, I'm not giving you these bird patties. I said, y'all done, y'all done all about the bird patty? He's like, yeah, we're going back and forth about the bird patty. Man, he just gonna grab my neck, you know what I'm saying? So I grabbed it, you know what I'm saying? We just went back and forth. I ended up getting him two bird patties. I took, I said, you gave him, you gave him the two bird patties, Sam? Man, I wasn't even trying to go. It's just very fast, man. We'll get him another day, man. I ain't true. So he had the scratches on the neck. I'm thinking, oh, okay, that's probably true, you know. Because down there in the kitchen, you know, they'll go back and forth about that little food down there, right? So after that, he come in one day. He hit me with the same move. Do, 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 do. And he come in early. So I look out the back window, and I'm seeing if any other other kitchen worker coming in early, right, Joe T? So I don't see nobody else coming in, right? So I hit the door. As soon as I hit the door, he hit me with the same thing. He was like, man, I got his bathroom, Sam. I got his bathroom. So I was like, Sam, how you keep? He was like, man, I'll tell you a minute, man. He was like, man, let me use the bathroom, Rick. Let me use the bathroom. So I closed the door, right? Like, Boom. I was standing right there, quick. I'm getting my cellar his privacy, right? I'm getting my cellar his privacy. He was like, man, I ain't even gonna lie, Joe T. I was like, man, something ain't, nah, something, something off, something off. So I popped the door on the Joe T. As soon as I heard the toilet flow, I popped the door, walk right in. Well, I would walk in. He washing two bombs out in the sink, go T. I'm talking about big John. I'm talking about big John. I'm telling you, I said, what? Yeah, he washing the bomb out in the sink. So you already know what that means. I said, washing the bomb out in the sink. I said, so what are you, what are you doing? Man, he packing, Joe T. Man, he packing, bro. Hey, man, bro, I'm talking about ball. I'm talking about, listen, I'm talking about ball like this here. Ball like this here. And he's like, the only way he doing that, he put one bomb in. Uh, somehow he probably shifting over and put another bomb in that Joe. I said, the whole time my silly been the mule. I ain't even knowing what's going on. He been striking up one of how he's smoking good. Uh, out of them two bombs, man, my cellar should have been getting a whole ounce out of them. I, and, I, and they probably had a, Q, a QP in there, Joe T. A QP, and then they probably had, of course, he been getting a little ASUS box. They probably got a little coke in there, a little, little dog food. They probably got, man, I'm telling you, the, the, the boy could have put a cell phone up in him. He's like, man, I come in, I was like, dang, tell him what you got going on. Whole time, he telling me, man, tell him. Silly man, I can explain, man. Look, silly man, it ain't nothing like that, man. I ain't, I ain't with no funny bit. Man, I don't care nothing about you putting nothing up the middle of your body. I want to know who bombs these is and what's going on. He tell me, man, look. So the girl down the boom, boom, boom. My silly already knew I was trying to come up with the girl, Josie. Whole time, she done start striking. Somebody else done start striking through her, right? Dude don't even work in the kitchen. Could across the hallway, right? Could across the hallway. So he started spraying the situation. I'm like, he don't work in the kitchen. I'm like, how, how he come up? Same way I did, don't he? He done had one of the kitchen workers down there. What's the game name? They slow, not knowing what's going on. He done pulled up on Facebook just like me. He hitting up, letting know. However, I'm guessing that's how he got in the car. He done bumped down on my ceiling. Tell my silly he gonna break bread with him. Make sure he's straight. Only thing he gotta do is bring the bomb back up here. Joe T, this man been down here. Listen, this man before work been said, I've been wondering why my cell smelling like baby oil every day before he go to work. When he come out and say, let me get the shower real Let me get the cell real quick. He ain't even been in this man, this man been in here stretching himself, Joe T. This man been in here stretching himself. Then he come in here smoking with me, doing a little something, bringing a little food in here. Maybe bring a little, they gonna tell me he been, he been swinging sandwiches. Man, Joe T the whole time, man, this man talking about, I got his bathroom, I got his bathroom. Whole time he got that bomb up in him. Joe T, I'm gonna get him to get that bomb. I said, whoa, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I said, bro, don't do that right there. What they gonna do, Joe T? I said, what you mean what they gonna do? He said, don't nobody know. Said, I'm paying myself. You just told me, and if you think I'm gonna let a wall go down on the behalf of what you just told me, you going in that thing, thing, and then you gonna go to the back. You, you ain't gonna be GD no more. You're gonna be over with it. And then any compound you go to, oh, you gonna get it. I'm thinking, I just ain't it. He gonna holler. And then, come on, bro. And then, look, look, look. Then in my cell, then in my cell, and say something. I'm smashing him. Man, you, <laughs> what? Man, he said, I'm smashing him like, I was like, four, four, five, seven. Dude, dude, what? So, so if they fall back and then you say, well, say you just gonna smash your silly. And you think you just gonna, but that, that bitch just rules the back. That's how it go. He like, I'm telling you, Josie. Ah. 
He gonna let me get that bomb, Joe T. He gonna let me get that bomb. I'm gonna come up. That, that's, that's my move right there. What they gonna do? What they gonna do? How they gonna? I said, man, listen, bro. Leave that alone, bro. Don't do that right there. Man, bro, I'm telling you, bro. It's too easy, bro. He don't need work down there in the kitchen, G. He don't need work down there in the kitchen. I'm gonna figure it out. This is it. That was a couple of days go by. <laughs> Folk done. Got his selling high and convinced it. This, 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 this is what he done ran down to his selling. Either you going to go down there and get the bomb, we going to work it together, or I can, he tell him this one plan. We can work it together that way, or we can get somebody, you know what I'm saying, to rob you, beat you up. You know what I'm saying? Say you not, they knocked out. You're going to have to go to the clinic, though. You're going to have to go to the clinic, say you were knocked out, you know what I'm saying? And you don't remember who it was. <laughs> you never tell me, tell me all these ways they can make this happen. And sell it high. So he sell it on the greed to go down here, take this bomb, and they going to make it. Because how they do the move is, he's saying, the girl, she gets, when she come in, she put the bombs in a specific place. His silly go in. Get the bomb, secure him, and and say he need to run back to the unit. He forgot some more, or she'll say they called him at that. She been letting him leave early. That way she could say she patted him. Boom, he walk across the yard with a with a uh, with a pass. He gonna make it. Hey, hey, where you coming from? Oh, they just coming back to the unit from the kitchen on the days he strike. Boom, he making it back. No if and buts about it. He ain't got to wait for all oh, the kitchen job. Boom, 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 boom. They pat him down, which is in the middle of his body anyway. He go on about his business. <laughs> this man, his selling includes somebody else in the move besides him. He know the kitchen. His selling know the kitchen too. I ain't never working in the kitchen. Well, I'm going to try to give you, I'm going to try to paint the picture for you so you can see how it, how it probably went. So wherever he... She putting the bomb at. She probably getting him to look. He knowing it's there. He busting the move. He going in there and get it. But whatever, wherever he going to get, other inmates probably got access to this same spot as well. So this is what you got to keep in mind. When she tell him to go in there and get it, which is probably hidden or whatever, he already know where to go get it from. But when he going in there, nine times out of ten, other inmates see him go in wherever he's going he done told his seller he'll do it probably on the, he done told him on the strength of he gd for one he gonna cover his selling he gonna let them know man my seller ain't did nothing like that do, 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 whatever 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 y'all got going because the crip ain't let his homeboys know he got homeboys who work in the kitchen whether they all on the same hood or not he got homeboys he could have went through to get that bomb and broke bread with them the same way he breaking bread with somebody who ain't nothing, which is going to be a problem. And a lot of times, the Crips going to make it like, man, Cud wasn't breaking bread anyway. Cud was acting funny. Cud could have let one of the homeboys go down there and get that. He got the homeboys he messing with. He messing with the white boy. The white boy don't want to. Got old on cousin. He hoping this had play out. Probably. You know what I'm saying? That, that's probably how, you know what I'm saying, you thinking about it and hoping that's how it's going to play out. His silly done went down here because he know how it look. Other people can see him. He done went down here and included somebody in the move. So he tells this person, look, I got to move. This is what's going on. I'm going to break bread with you. Because he thanking folk for the break bread with him. So he making it like he got to move. He, he tell him to go in the spot to get the bomb. And bring it to him. Therefore, if somebody see him go in there, they gonna be able. Cause by the time the girl it come missing and they come back to her and they asking, of course the girl can do her whatever little and ask and they can say, oh I seen such and such <laughs> go in there. If it come down to that, or the homeboys if they start asking, hey man, cause such 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 such, such. she said, you know what I'm saying? What you? Oh I seen. So it was smart in a sense. Is just who he picked. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They put some pressure on who you, and you think you just finna get a little something, you know what I'm saying? This is where the problem come in at. A lot of times you got people riding in the car. 
You don't know who Rodney Collins and let me know you ain't never been to the penitentiary. You ain't never been to the penitentiary. I advise you never go because penitentiary rules is in effect. When you say riding in the car, that's usually it's the same thing with going to visit. You might got somebody to come up here and your, your people might not can get a ride. You be like, man, let me ride in the car with you. And they pick your people up, you know what I'm saying, or they meet them, and they ride and come to visit. It's the same thing when it comes to the ball. A lot of people, you know what I'm saying, can it, they can make money, free money, get free narcotics off of letting people get in on the move because they don't have a move. So if I come to you and I say, man, what's up, bro? I got to, you know what I'm saying, I, I can get it, you know what I'm saying, I just know you can get in. I got two ounces of weed, and he say, I, I want an ounce hopper. It sounds like a lot, but really in the penitentiary, it's not because you're going to try triple whatever you paid off of one ounce anyway, so you cool with basically giving away or not. But they probably wouldn't, depending on who you're dealing with and how dry it is, what they're going to charge you. So you letting other people in the car, especially with what they say, hard drugs, when you got pills, white, that, that dog food, little stuff like that, some boxing, and you saying, oh, man, I got a, I got 75 pills. You can fit that inside and compress it inside a bundle of some brown or some green so you can get a few things in there. You might got another person be like, man, I got a quarter of some dog food. Man, I want two grams off the quarter. I want two grams off the white. So you running it up. Whoever he getting his bond for got people in the car. They off different goods. <laughs> One of them might be GD. One of them might be the people. He just got to move. So he got other things going on. And if you want to hear the rest of this story, you need to go to the new page. Okay, so boom one is tagged in the title. And as I said, I got two more besides this one coming to the membership page. You already know what time it is. It's your guy. So this man go down here and tell somebody else to go get the bomb right. The dude go get the bomb, get the dude, do. Bring the bomb back like he always do. And uh she don't let he don't leave early. This day he's this way. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. When he get the bomb, when he get the when the dude get him the bomb, keep in mind other people can see. So the dude, he go to the girl and was like, What's up, everything good? And she like, Yeah, it's in there. Did you go in there? He was like, I was just asking normally, you know what I'm saying? You let me know soon. And I just seen somebody else go in there. She was like, Oh, yeah, it's good. You can go on in there. I'm sure everything's straight. So he go in there, boom. When he go in, boom, he come out. He go straight through. He like, what's up? It ain't in there. She like, well, well, where is that then? He was like, man, I don't know. It ain't got nothing to do with, with, with. So they go back and forth or whatever. She already asking questions about who done went in this room. So they spook. Somebody go and tell her, man, I seen such a good. In this situation.